it is this month and you're welcome to explicit chemistry uh, today I'll be looking at calculations on solubility I'm hoping that you must have gone through the theory part and then we are only going to treat the calculations on solubility okay uh, let's just look at definitions as we are seeing on our screen solubility of a solute in a particular solvent is the amount of solute in moles or grams that will dissolve in one dm cube or 1000 cm cube at a particular temperature yeah so the emphasis here is that solubility is the amount of solutes is the amount of solutes all right solutes that's either in grams or in moles or in grams sorry now to dissolve in one dm cube which is likened to 1000 cm cube at a particular temperature of course solubility works with a specific temperature okay so um we have a question here which we're going to use as our first question before we look at other questions so this is saying that uh, 25 grams of potassium chloride were dissolved in 80 grams of distilled water at 30 degrees centigrade. Calculate the solubility of the solute in mole per dm cube. So the question can also say that we should calculate the solubility in gram per dm cube. But this one is asking us to calculate the solubility in mole per dm cube. So what we need to do is first we we'll convert 25 cm cube, I mean 25 grams, convert 25 grams into its equivalent in moles. And to get that number of moles, we know that it is reacting mass all over all over molar mass. And our reacting mass here is 25. And our molar mass, molar mass of what now? Of potassium chloride. Potassium is 39 plus chlorine is 35.5. So we add them together, we are going to have 39 plus 35.5. We are looking at 74.5. So when you divide it, our number of moles will be equals to 0 0.336 moles. Now, these moles is simply the equivalent of 25 grams. But in this case, it is in moles. And why do I have to convert to moles? Because our question asks us to provide the solubility or calculate the solubility of the solute in mole per dm cube, of course, not in gram per dm cube, and that is why we must continue or we have to convert it down to moles. Okay, I assume that is clear. So, having gotten the equivalent of 25 in mole per dm cube, next thing we need to do now is to relate it. Okay, so just like saying that 25 grams. Of potassium chloride dissolve in 80 grams of water but in this case so 25 grams we have covered 25 grams to moles so we'll say 0 0.336 moles of potassium chloride dissolved in 80 gram 80 gram of water of 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 this two water Now this is what we're given, 25 grams, which is the same thing as 0 0.33 moles, when converted, dissolve in 80 grams of distilled water, as provided by the question, 80 grams here, all right? So what is now the number of moles that will dissolve in 1000 cm cube? Because that is the solubility, the solubility, solubility is the solubility of the solute 
at a particular temperature is the amount of solutes in moles or in grams that will dissolve in 1 dm cube or 1000 cm cube. All right, so what we're giving the question for dissolving 80. So we want to know the amount that will dissolve in 1000. At this point, we're going to assume that it is x. So let x, let x moles of potassium chloride dissolve in 1000 cm cube. Of course, of distilled water. Now, this is now the solubility. Whatever the value of x is, is the solubility. That's the amount of solute that is dissolving in 1000 cm cube. Note that the question gave us 25 grams, which will convert to 0 0.336 moles of potassium chloride to give, that will dissolve in 80 grams of water. Now, the solubility, which is the amount that dissolves in 1000 cm cube, is given as x. All right? Is given as x so at this point we are going to make x a subject formula get the value of x and that represents our solubility all right okay this is it now so let's go x will cross multiply and multiply 1000 i mean 0 0.0336 sorry will multiply 1000 while x will multiply 80 cross multiplication so that we want to have we're going to have 80x equals to 0 0.336 times times 1000 yeah so arithmetic making x subject the formula divide both sides by 80 divide both sides by 80 this will go with that so x is equals to 0 0.336 times 1000 will give us 336 over 80. When we divide that, we're going to have about uh, yeah 4.2 moles. So, what it simply means is that 4.2 moles of 4.2 moles of potassium chloride will dissolve in. Okay, let me just write it for will dissolve in 1000 cm cube of distilled water at 30 degrees centigrade and now this is solubility 4.20 moles okay so that is how we solve this question and i'm going to solve another question in the next video you can drop your question or comments in the comment section i'll go through it if you have any questions on the beauty you drop it there too i'll go through it and solve it as soon as i can thank you good luck